Super 8 TG8001 tablet the first 8 core tablet we, that we have right here and it has a pretty 8 on the box and on the back is all the specs that, um, and all the features this tablet has okay let's take a look at the tablet itself so we have been waiting for this tablet for a long time and now it's finally finally arrived and I am very excited for this tablet okay so here is the user manual and in this little <coughs> sorry in this little long box is the US USB um, cable okay and in this box that's going to come in your package is the power adapter and charger so yeah okay let's take a look at our baby here so it is pure white so right now we only have this color available and to me it looks like a big smartphone because of the design that you know it has the home button but and the back button and manual here so it does look like a big version of a smartphone and here is the logo TMG Super 8 here is the power button volume up volume down and nothing on this side here the speaker there are two of them that Okay, and here we have the power charging port, <clears throat> earphone port, HDMI, um, USB. So this is a long, uh, long version of the USB connection. So yeah, it goes right in there. Um, this is for the TF card, um, aka micro, uh, micro SD card. And here's the same card slot that it only has one SIM card slot that supports regular um, SIM card as opposed to micro SIM card. So my card is already in there and we're going to test the calling function of the tablet later. Oh yeah, so let me turn the tablet on. Okay, so here is the front camera, that's 2 megapixel, as well as the sensor right here. And the back camera with LED light is 5 megapixel. So I mean for a tablet like this, it's a pretty decent size and it's very thin, so it's good to bring with you everywhere. And yeah, it takes a couple seconds to turn on pretty fast. Um, okay, let's see. So here's all the apps that we have, and this is the widget. Say I want to put um, this one right here. There you go. <laughs> okay, whatever. Um, yeah, I can play around with it. So it's very good to um, to be able to customize your desktop. And all right, let's see the calling function of the tablet that's called China Telecom let me put on speaker so the volume is decent I would say the speaker is actually pretty good and yeah normally for this tablet you probably don't put it over your ear so <laughs> just use uh, um, earphone so that's probably better and all right are you ready for the miracle moment let's open enter two and you will be amazed in three seconds three two one okay here we go this is the enter two score is very very impressive one of the highest I have ever seen and it says good job welcome to the world of high-end smartphones I mean smartphones tablet are the same thing right as long as it's Android um, yeah okay let's choose something to compare it with 
All right, note two. Since note three is not available yet for comparison, so let's look at this tablet versus note two. And the, it is almost 7,000 score higher than the note two. And multitask, it, all, it is also a lot higher. So it's gonna run f uh, much faster uh, when you multitask. And um, it also outperforms not to um, CPU integer, CPU float point, um, RAM speed, 2D and 3D graphics, which is very impressive, and storage, I.O. Yeah, so I would say this is a very, very good tablet, compare, even compared with, you know, Samsung. Um, Note 2. Okay, let's take a look at all the details. So, um, it is Android 2.2, 4.2.2, uh, and CPU is Samsung Exynos. I think that's how you pronounce it, but whatever. Um, 5410. Screen resolution is 812 times 1280. Alright, we've covered camera so and this is the memory is 2 gig of RAM plus 16 gig of ROM so which is plenty space and the 2 gig of RAM also supports you know multitask as well as the system is going to be much faster um, yeah it says quad core four cores here but um, if you are familiar with Samsung CPU that it is um, double quad core so which is octa core um yeah speed is up to 1.6 gigahertz um screen is ips capacitive touch screen pretty good and yeah so yep the camera pretty good two two megapixel and five megapixel and um it supports you to take 1080p video and yeah, it's a good size to bring it with you outside, so you can take good video with it. Okay. Yeah, so that's everything that the tablet support and not support. Okay, so since this tablet is, one, uh, is the fir first 8-core tablet that we have, so I assume the speed processing speed should be faster than regular tablet or I mean quad core tablet so I have downloaded an app right here which is into the dad by a Chinese all right so after that let's take a look at and to, to a hardware tester here is the LCD test for colors so there is no you know flaw on the screen and it displays the color pretty well pretty standard and it does support multi-touch so five yep so it has five touch points so it's good when you play games like fruit ninja so you can use your five fingers all together okay so here's settings it has Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and Ethernet. So it's good that you can just connect it with the Ethernet um, when there's no Wi-Fi, since Wi-Fi is not available everywhere. Okay. Here you can adjust all the settings, and um, it has GPS. Here are all the languages it supports pretty good many different languages since we ship to worldwide and it's good to have different languages all right tablet information as mentioned previously model number or the CPU as well as Android 4.2.2 and there will be a software update later so please pay attention to our blog because um, all the newest firmware as well as you know, updates is going to be posted on our blog. So yeah, here is the GPS test. Just want to show you guys real quick. 
Yep, so it's on. I haven't um, adjusted, so yeah, just want to show you guys that. Alright, let's take a look at camera. Uh, yeah, camera. <laughs> and then we'll go to um, gallery. So it does not have um, touch focus or, you know, yeah, but it does have autofocus. And I think that's pretty good. Pretty nice picture. Nice focus, I would say. And you can see a little bit of noise from the background, but I think that's okay. It doesn't, you know, affect the, <laughs> the performance too too much. Yeah. So yeah, as long as it, yeah. Hold on. And it also supports 1080p video. Um, here is all the settings of the camera, like rotation, flashlight settings and white balance and all that yeah okay let's take a look at some or one video that is 1080p and comes with a tablet The graphic is pretty good, I would say, and it runs really smooth too. And the color is very vivid, I would say. I can't use my left hand. So it's, um, the video quality is very good when you play it on this tablet and um, the volume is not too loud but I think it's pretty decent. You know, when you are at home alone, you can enjoy a movie with the speaker. So I would say it's pretty, pretty good performance. And all right, it's time for some games. Here is our Subway Surfer. So the screen is very sensitive and pretty good for this kind of game. You do need a good screen to get a high score. Oh well. <laughs> okay. And here is a death death model. Model. Yeah. Okay, no thanks. A very violent game that I'm sure guys will enjoy it more than girls do. <laughs> So this kind of game te um, test the G sensor. Oh god! I mean, yeah, <laughs> the G sensor of the tablet. So you can see it does have pretty good gravity gravity sensor. There you go. Ha! Whoa! All right, so it runs pretty smooth for games like this okay um let's see if the wi-fi work in this room as you can see the wi-fi connection in this room is not too good but yeah right now at geekbuying we're selling this tablet for 323 dollars 
So as the world first um, eight core tablet, or you know, at our store. Um, so please check it out. It's it's a very cool and unique item that we have right now. Okay, it looks like the Wi-Fi has given up, but yeah, um, please check it out. And if you like this review, please subscribe to our YouTube channel as well as adding us on the Facebook page. So thank you for your time. I'll see you next time. Bye.